Well today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be checking out Rob Scallon's brand new signature guitar lineup from Schechter. Let's get into it. So what is going on everybody? Thank you so much for joining me for today's video. My name is Ray. I'm a guitar player here on YouTube and I just have to say a huge congrats to Rob Scallon. This is massive, man. I haven't done too much research on this topic I'm about to bring up, but I don't know if there's ever been a guitar player ever to get a 6, a 7, and an 8 string guitar at once, at one time, and an initial launch. Maybe somebody out there, but even regardless, man, there's only a couple other players that I can think of that have a 6 string, 7 string, and 8 string signature guitar. I mean, Stephen Carpenter and John Petrucci are like the only two that I can think of. So, really amazing to see this, you know, be all dropped and released at once. So, congrats to Rob. It's pretty amazing. So, I'm on the Schechter Guitars website, and I just want to just, you know, check them out real quick, just look them over, and just give my thoughts and opinions on them, okay? So, starting right off, what I think is my least favorite of the three is the plain old regular six string. Now, obviously, there's nothing wrong with this guitar, but aesthetically, it's a little bit more reserved. And hearing Rob talk about these guitars on his own channel, he kind of just wants a little bit more of a classy look, and just having some nice wood and some wood grain showing. That's kind of his vibe, and it's been his vibe for the majority of his career, you know? These guitars are mahogany neck throughs with swamp ash wings. We got hip shot hardware. One thing that's really interesting is the pickups. Check these out. We have Schechter Diamond 78 Special Rob Scallon and Schechter Diamond 78 Rob Scallon. So, sounds like we have Rob Scallon branded pickups. At the very least, they're branded with the Anchor logo, kind of Rob Scallon's signature identifying, you know, emblem or whatever. Um, so, I don't know if they're voice for Rob, but they're definitely, um, you know, a little special because they have the anchor decal on them. So that's a cool, nice little, cool little added touch there. Locking tuners, 25 and a half inch scale, hip shot hardware, if I didn't say that already. Just a really kind of classy, nice looking guitar. I mean, I really like these photos down here where you can see the back and you can see the wood grain, see the mahogany, the natural wood. Looks really, really nice. Nice little added feature here as well as the anchor with the little Rob Scallon logo. Nice feature where it's like, yeah, it's a signature guitar, but it's not too flamboyant of like, this is a, a Rob Scallon guitar. It's not in your face. It's subtle. That's nice. And I think more often than not, we welcome that as consumers, right? And last but not least, these are made in Korea. So pretty high end stuff from Schechter. Now, if you take a look right here, we have several lefty guitars. We have all, all three guitars in lefty in six, seven, and eight strings. So that's awesome. Obviously called out is Rob Scallon's given a lot of love to the lefties because the lefty guitar players out there, they kind of get neglected. It's, it's unfortunate, you know what I mean? So really cool to see Rob look after, you know, that demographic. But now let's just jump right to it. I want to get to the eight string, man. $1,600, that's relatively affordable in today's market. Um, I'm assuming all the specs are the same, but we have a multi-scale fan fret. I'm curious to see what the fan scale length is. Ah, okay, 27 to 25 and a half. So pretty standard. Uh, that's what most multi-scale guitars that I've ever, you know, come across you know, are, are specced out as. So 27 on the low eight string, that's pretty conservative in terms of a scale length. However, you know, this is Rob's guitar. It's what he's probably most comfortable with. So, you know, obviously it works for him. So that's super rad, dude. And just out of curiosity, I want to check out what the scale length is on the seven string as well. Oh, wow, 26 and a quarter. That's a very subtle fan. So just enough to get the tension on the low strings. Pretty interesting, 26 and a quarter. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. Yeah, so obviously everybody overall, like I'm not a huge super fan of these. They look really classy and really like elegant, we'll say, um, and more reserved. So, you know, it's got the signature Rob Scallon look with the wood stripe and all that. So this is this is his his bread and butter, you know what I mean? So um, definitely a really classy looking guitar. And I think they nailed it in that regard. So everybody, those are my thoughts. Just a quick little video. Just wanted to let you guys know about this news story. It's pretty cool and inspiring to see somebody who started out on this very platform is now just, you know, skyrocketing their career and just, you know, being incredibly successful. So it's inspiring. So anyway, uh, with that being said, what do you guys think of these guitars? Leave all your thoughts down below and I'll meet you down below in the comments. With that being said, I am out of here. Stay safe, stay healthy and stay metal. See you guys next time. Later.